College students and others are moving in and out of apartments or homes right now. This time of year, there really are a lot of people looking for new or used furniture or even to get rid of furniture. And that's where furniture amnesty comes into play. KSNT News reporter James Ryan is live in Manhattan right now to explain how this unique holiday in the Little Apple helps clear up waste. Brittany, every year there are a bunch of college students who are sitting in empty apartments on cardboard boxes trying to eat dinner like their dinner tables. I know because I've done it. And that's kind of where Furniture Amnesty Day tries to come into play. Now, throughout the day tomorrow, people can drop off their used furniture here at City Park and people can show up and pick up what they like. Kind of like a swap meet or flea market, but everything's free. Furniture Amnesty Day really serves, um, serves all of those needs. So people who are in need of furniture and then also making sure that furniture doesn't end up on the side of the road or in some of our alleyways. Starting at 8 tomorrow morning, you can come here and get signed up for a time slot between 11 and 4 where you can come and check out the furniture. And after 4, people are free to come and take what they please. And along with sol solving some of the public health concerns, it also deals with waste. A lot of times, you know, people, uh, college students will go to a big, big department store and get kind of the same cheap furniture because, you know, you can only afford so much that people get every year. And a lot of times that can end up in landfills or, as they were saying, on the side of alleyways or the side of roads. So instead of going down and you spending the money, maybe come down here and see what you can get for free that's just as good. Live in Manhattan. James Ryan, Case and T News. Well, sounds like a great event to take part in. Thank you, James, for the details. Now, if you cannot make it, though, to City Park to donate or you can't move some of the items by yourself, the city will come by to pick up your donations. You just have to sign up on the Manhattan City website by 5 p.m. today.